Now to a Detroit mother behind bars and facing felony charges in the death of her 18 day old daughter. 7 Action News reporter Simon Shaquette is live downtown outside 36th uh, District Court. Simon, this case is heartbreaking to be sure. What did the mother have to say about this in court? Dave, the mother answered some questions from the magistrate. She also acknowledged that she understood the charges here at 36th District Court, but she did not show any emotion for what happened when she appeared on that video arraignment. 22-year-old mother Jayla Thomas with this reaction as Magistrate Don White reads her charges in open court. In this video arraignment, Thomas formally learning she's accused of involuntary manslaughter and second-degree child abuse for the death of her 18-day-old infant, Lauren Williams, on the morning of August 26th. Count one homicide manslaughter involuntary. It's a felony with a penalty of 15 years and or $7,500. Count two child abuse, second degree. It's a felony with a penalty of 10 years. Prosecutors say Thomas was drinking excessively alone in her apartment on Shaner when she found her child unresponsive, floating face down in the bathtub. The baby pronounced dead by EMS soon after, and the cause determined to be drowning. The prosecutor calling this appalling and has publicly blasted the mother for being intoxicated. In court, the mother not indicating if she's taken the step of hiring an attorney or asking for a public defender. Ma'am, did you hear the charges and the penalties that you could receive? Yes. All right, the court's going to enter a not guilty plea on your behalf. You a $150,000 bond was set for Thomas, who is due back in court September 12th. A GoFundMe page is set up to help with funeral expenses, and you'll find that on WXYZ.com. Coming up at 5, how the family says they are planning to honor the memory of that little girl. Live downtown, Simon Shaquette, 7 Action News. Simon, thank you for the live report.